all the things that your friends. Welcome to a new edition of the IoT Friday. Today I would like to talk of how to start with the Internet of Things. Because a lot of people ask me, hey, uh, I have an idea, I would like to start something, uh, I would like to dedicate some of my weekends on Internet of Things or to learn how to code, etc. And this video is dedicated to, to them to just give ideas of how to do it to start with an Internet of Things idea. So let's start. If you're a designer, I have three possible plans for you. So first is design something. If you have, if you have a problem, or if you think about a problem that can be solved through design, just design something and make it happen. Second, go and use a 3D printer. So 3D printers are getting cheaper and cheaper. Or even you can go to Fab Labs or maker spaces in your city, probably, and learn and meet other community of people who are actually experts on 3D printing, because there are a lot of different machines uh, for different needs, etc. So use a 3D printer and maybe you can start designing uh, or printing what you actually design in the first point. Finally, my suggestion if you are a designer is you need to learn to code. So there are a lot of platforms where you can, that are very easy to learn how to code. So I really suggest you to learn how to code. Second, if you're a developer and you are tired of being a consultancy, a consultant, etc., I suggest you to buy electronics to start hack and start hacking them. So you can buy Arduinos, you can buy electric imps, you can buy Raspberry Pis, Intel Edison, etc. These are very kind of cheap uh, electronics with a lot of things to build on the top, a lot of sensors and actuators to connect on, and that actually will give you an idea of what is the Internet of Things, what does it mean to connect a sensor and an actuator to the Internet. Second, it's when you have the electronic at home, build something funny. So, if you want to spend your weekends, etc., you have to have, you need to have fun to, to hack electronics, etc., so this is my suggestion. And finally, if you're a good developer and you build some stuff, please meet a designer. Uh, he will help you a lot, or she will help you a lot, improving what you are building or you are developing. Finally, if you're a businessman and you don't have uh, skills on development or on design, no problem. Have an idea. Have a business idea, a good business idea that can scale a lot and can get sold and, and get traction of customers, etc. So I think having a good idea, uh, it's, it's always important, an idea that can monetize. And second, go and meet developers and designers, tell the idea to them, and just team up to make a scalable uh, business. Uh, my suggestion is you can go to meetups of Internet of Things, meetups of whatever, uh, entrepreneurship, etc. And there you can find developers and designers who actually have a lot of development skills or, or are very good designers but actually don't have this business side of expertise that you can actually uh, give to them. So this is uh, my five uh, suggestions if you are, want to get started on the, on the Internet of Things. Just team up with interesting people, learn how to code and just have fun. Okay, so see you the next IoT Friday. Bye-bye.